it's a great place to raise a family. Like these things stick out to me as, as, as uh, ways to measure a place essentially. So I had a strong and favorable impression of Uruguay from that. Um, you know, I spent a lot of time in different countries in Europe. I never lived in any country in Europe, but I spent a fair amount of time there to see, you know, I've, and maybe I'm influenced too much by Doug where Doug says, you know, the history of Europe is one giant blood stain, you know, or something like that. It makes you think that, uh, you know, it's, it's not going to be the most stable place. A friend of mine says about Uruguay, he says in world war one, not much changed in Uruguay in world war two. The only thing that changed in Uruguay is that they had, you know, new markets for their cattle. And he says, world war three, I think Uruguay is going to be the same and kind of boring, but the same. So there's a lot of other benefits I think of Uruguay, but basically the culture here is one where it's non-confrontational. It's an agriculture oriented place. People, a lot of people would consider it boring, but as Doug has said, it's kind of a mark of an uneducated man if you find yourself bored. 